Welcome to our channel. Um, today I'm gonna do a video about how to fix a Roman style faucet for a bathtub. Uh, this is not what we usually do on this channel but uh, I have this broken uh, faucet and I didn't really find any video on YouTube so here I am doing a video about this. Now what happened was um, this actually sits on top like this and my daughter she just kept moving it and it, it just fall apart and there is no video on YouTube how to fix this so I'm doing this. If you have this kind of faucet then here's what you need to do okay so I'm going to explain you how this works. Okay so here are the parts okay so uh, uh, this black part uh, goes right in here okay then this part which is of brass sits right on top of this so there is a screw mechanism right here and this ridges goes on to it so once this is hooked up this black part is attached to this part by a screw which goes if you can see right underneath here and this part holds the screw holds this two part together okay now what happens is this part goes into the main uh, faucet just like this all right and then there is this small little screw right here which goes in here and holds that in place so you can easily turn it on so i hope this all makes sense it will make more sense once i go ahead and start attaching everything okay so the first thing is if this falls off you take this part out okay which is this small little screw and once it's off you will be able to take this uh, brass golden part out of it okay uh, now what you want to do is uh, you will see that this part would have fallen in here okay so i use a small scissor to uh, pick it out of here now that the screw is out i want to make sure that these two parts are hold it up like this because this is which will turn the whole knob uh, open and close so before we proceed you need to make sure that you close the water line okay because if you don't then the water will start rushing out of here so you need to make sure that you close that okay once that's closed you also need to make sure that this goes on in here so you, what you want to do is you want to put this like this all right now this part uh, the shorter part goes into here the broader part attaches up right here okay so this is now a unit now here's what you want to do this fall apart so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it in I got a regular screwdriver okay with uh, four points and I'm going to put it in and I'm going to tie it up real tight because that's what happened in the first place my daughter just keep wobbling it and it just fall apart so now that it feels that it's it's tight all right and it's snug in place all right uh, then you just go ahead and start screwing this up all right once it's done all the way okay then you're all set to put this one on okay you need to make sure that you clean all this dirt around here so uh, for now i don't see any rust or dirt so i'm just going to put this whole thing on top okay so once this thing is on top the last part you probably forgot to put this one in but it really doesn't matter it's just a visor i'm gonna keep it out anyways so i'm gonna put this whole thing in you want to make sure that you don't place it in an awkward angle you want to put it right here just like the other side okay once that's in place uh, you want to put this little screw right in now for this I'm using this uh, this type of uh, a screwdriver uh, it's it's really hard to find in common utility so I have linked uh, the, in the description down below uh, this multi-purpose screwdriver you can use this for a lot of stuff like repairing mobile phones and uh, clocks and stuff like that but there are a lot of uh, functional ports in here so you can check out the link in the description once you get this all you want to do is put it in here and just start tightening it up once you feel that it's tightened up all the way all right then there you go 
Now since the water line is closed, the water didn't turn up, but it's, it's nice and secure and it's right in place. This is what I wanted. What happened was over time I just got my daughter keep pulling it and the screw which I showed in the first place fall down and that's what caused problem in the first place. Now that is fixed and it's all good to go. So I really hope you guys found this video helpful. Please leave a comment down below if you have any questions. Make sure you like this video and share this video so it can help a lot of other people out there. And I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Take care, bye. Thank <laughs> you.